name's Shannon Kyrie, and this is your Morning Meridian. We're here this morning with Reese Strongfork, the CEO and re-founder of Atlas Corporation. Welcome, Reese! Great to be here, Shannon. Reese, in bringing Atlas back into the galactic market, you've done something many would have thought impossible only a decade ago. What's the secret to your success? Secret alien technology, Shannon. <laughs> I'm kidding. Atlas is thriving because we've taken it in a new direction. I believe a company should lift its employees on its shoulders. Cool if I take this. Thanks. Later. Oh, hey. I was just out here looting corpses. But wait, you're a vault hunter like Maya used to be? Go on adventures, save the universe, kill bad guys? Yeah, I get to kill bad guys pretty much all the time. It's great. Yes! That's so freaking cool, I want to die instantly. I'm going to be a vault hunter too. Or I would be if Maya assigned me more than just guarding a dusty-ass library and staring at water for like a hundred hours. Sorry, just really boring around here. So, we're gonna loot this graveyard or what? What you got, Gate? Nothing, bitch! You got nothing! Come on. Oh, crap! Attention, everyone! This is Captain Trunch! Those monks are in that spooky graveyard! Wipe them out and make me proud! Then we'll go out for a soft serve! Cones on trot! God, I hate her already. Maya says the monks put iridium in tombs, so the dead have some spending money in the afterlife. We'll pay him back later. Like, if we're not all dead. Huh. Weak. But I know a few more places we can try. I got this one. Ah, oh, it's sticky! Why? Why is it sticky? Oh, monks are so weird. I don't know, man. That's a pretty sexy door. Dying to get inside that anchor hold ever since I got here. Something about locked doors, man. Makes my palms itch. No! Rage attack! Run! This wasn't in my contract! What the hell?
God, I love that the auto is so buggy. So much fun. Can't hear anything that she says, so have fun with that. the fun fighting off Malawan, but screw that! That Tron guy is the worst and I want to kick his dick off myself! <sighs> Ava, go protect the grain storerooms. Let the Vault Hunter take care of Malawan. <sighs> Got it, Maya. On my way. All I ever do is protect archives or storerooms or sacred whatevers. I'll see you later, Vault Hunter. Huh. Ava really took a shine to you. Might want to check your pockets. She was a stowaway on one of our seasonal merchant ships. We... crossed paths. She tried to steal my book, and instead of throwing her off a cliff, I decided to train her as my apprentice. I've got my book and heading your way in a sec. I'm just finishing up some- Die, you corporate bastards! Exercises. What's better? propaganda.
I'll say this as politely as I can. Please consider surrendering while we trample your treasured heritage just cause uh, we're better than you. That's what I do.
Trant. Good riddance. Oh, was his name Trant? You got the Iridium? Give it here! I've never been able to use Iridium the way Lilith does, but I found a technique in this book that might change that. Okay, here goes... something. Holy crap! I feel like I could phase lock a planet right now! Teach me that right now! Ooh, I could get used to that kind of power! Okay, let's get the key fragment, Vault Hunter. By the violent ways of our saviors. You survived the invasion. Guess all those hours staring at water taught you something after all. <laughs> I can handle myself. I learned to fight way before I met you. Let's spar then, kid. Oh, you know, I would, but I've got a loot to sort through. Nope. Go pack a bag. You get your wish. We're leaving with the Vault Hunter. Wait, for real? I mean, yeah, cool, whatevs. Could be fun. I'll grab my stuff. Vault Hunter, check this out. The Iridians left messages like these all over the galaxy. I always figured there was a connection between sirens and vaults. I can't read it, but it must mean something. No making heads or tails of this. This relic's been here since before I was born. But as long as Malawan knows it's here, Athenus will never be safe. I should tell you this before I explain it to Lilith. The real reason I took Ava on as an apprentice? She's going to be a siren. Someday. And I want to make sure she's ready when that happens. See you up in the stars, Vault Hunter. place in the galaxy with more sirens than Athenas. Must be something in their water. Or sirens were drawn to the place by some sort of, I don't know, call? I stayed for a few years until Queen Dido passed away. Then some monks in the Order of the Impending Storm took over the joint. One day, some skeezy monk, he pulls me aside and says he'll pay plenty if I bring him another siren. I slap him in the face with my Vercuvian backhand and hopped in my ship. Never came back. The moral of this story is that monks suck! Typhon had an affair with the Siren Queen Dido! Astounding! And tantalizing! Oh, and another cache has been revealed. I'm Shannis Kyrie, and this is your... Our morning Meridian! We're here this morning with Reese Strongfork, the CEO and re-founder of Atlas Corporation. Welcome, Reese! Great to be here, Shannon. Reese, in bringing Atlas back into the galactic market, you've done something many would have thought impossible only a decade ago. What's the secret to your success? Secret alien technology, Shannon. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Atlas is thriving because we've taken it in a new direction. I believe a company should lift its employees on its shoulders, not the other way around. And what about your competition? Atlas has been attracting a lot of attention. Have you had any buyout offers? I'll be honest, we've gotten some pretty uh, aggressive offers from certain legacy weapons brands, but I'm not selling. Atlas is a standalone brand. And it's gonna stay that way. As long as I'm alive. Ah, uh, why'd I say that? You, you, you can cut that, right? Right? Slide? Ah, Jerry, why do you always schedule these things? I hope you can see why I like Jacob so much.
so fucking good. 